Hey there, fellow recovery pilgrims. I'm Jonathan, and in this recovery discovery session, I want to talk about good pain versus bad pain. Now, when I'm talking about pain, I'm primarily meaning discomfort as a result of our choices, not necessarily, you know, physical pain. Did you know that recovery involves pain? I bet you wish that wasn't true. I, I have. But did you also know that recovery pain is good? Now, how can you tell the difference between good pain of recovery and bad pain of addiction? Here are three distinct differences and outcomes between recovery pain and addiction pain. First, recovery pain is a result of denying self. Addiction pain is a result of worshiping self. Addiction trains you to make everything in your life center on you. This results in the pain of broken promises and relationships and eventual poor health, mentally, emotionally, physically, and even spiritually. Recovery, however, retrains you to center everything in your life around God. This means you are not the autonomous master of your life. God is. And through the pain of self-denial and submission to God, you discover the beautiful freedom of hope, joy, and love. Number two, recovery pain focuses on a better future. Addiction pain can't see past right now. Addiction deludes you into believing that all that matters is how you feel right now, and if you get your fix, it will make everything better. But this trades the truth for a lie. You actually are trading future peace and joy for an immediate short-lived thrill. Recovery teaches you to see beyond the right now and strive for a better future to trade the lie of an immediate utopia through acting out for the truth of a hopeful, sober future that comes through the temporary pain of saying no to urges and cravings. Three, recovery pain lessens over time, whereas addiction pain worsens over time. Addiction is a perpetual cycle of re-wounding yourself over and over again. Addiction never gets better by acting out more. Now, although the self-denial and long-term vision of recovery is painful at first, it eventually leads to the comfort and peace of sobriety. Recovery pain lessens the more you heal and sober up. So which pain do you want? The good pain of recovery or the ever-worsening bad pain of addiction? I know that the answer is simple, right? But the choice is hard. So what's one step you will take today to move toward the good pain of recovery? It won't be easy, but it will be worth it. Thanks for listening. If you have a recovery discovery you'd like to share with us, please send it to recoverydiscovery at puresexradio.com or text it to 210-549-8748. And until next time, keep pressing on.